to my next walkthrough. Yeah. Welcome, everyone, to the Black Yoshi's Resident Evil 2 walkthrough. If you do not know me, I will be your host, the Black Yoshi. So, this is supposed to be our, or I guess you could say my, fresh start. Since we are done with uh, that, nay, that game I shall not mention. <laughs> ah, shit. Um, little inside scoop for y'all. A range mode is basically the definition of very easy. You get a machine gun. Original, you get kind of easy mode is kind of like medium mode and then normal mode is about the hardest mode you can get on the A campaign. If you go to B, I believe the B campaigns are harder than the A. It's either that or they're alternate or both. They're both. Um this is the PlayStation 3 and 360 uh edition of Resident Evil 2. I had a PlayStation 1 copy, but one it's not around anymore for cuz it wasn't mine to keep. But, uh, never mind that. Because we're going to start this walkthrough. Hell yeah, we must start this walkthrough. Uh, A bizarre incident occurred. In the bizarre, more like fucking ugly. Southern Look at that. He's Raccoon like, City. that is rape face right there. It was later revealed that the <laughs> someone was molested had been that night by the T virus, a mutagenic toxin created by the international enterprise Umbrella Incorporated. Fucking Umbrella, for man. Use in bio weapon experiments. Zars. It's like a Z. Stars immediately began investigation. Big explosion at the end, like every fucking Resident Evil game. <clears throat> the Umbrella Corporation. <clears throat> the graphics. The great, aren't they? No, they were not. They were not finished. Of course they weren't. Let's switch. <laughs> oh shit. Raccoon City, baby. It's funny because actually this place looks... Diner. <laughs> this place actually looks very clean. It just looks like an empty city. It's all... Doesn't look bloody or dirty or anything, except for that. Just a flat out dead woman. Told you someone was getting raped. Here? Leon. You look so young. Tax ago. <laughs> Bikes. He's a zombie, that's why. Man, what a mess. What could have done this? A zombie? Shit, it's like y'all are new to this. What was that? What are these things? Alright, that's far enough. Don't move! I wanna know why everything's so clean. Don't move. Like there's no barricades, no rubble. No! It's like everything's fucking just Wow, one bullet. Leon's a hacker, killing everything with one shot. He's got aimbot for days. Titty zombie. Leon's a hacker. Shoot! Oh, wait! Don't shoot! shoot. Look at that aimbot for days. We can't stay out here. Head to the police station. You're a hacker, Leon. Yes, I am, baby. That's another thing. If you ever have played Call of Duty online, which I'm sure everyone's done at least one point in time, 
then there are those moments that happen a little bit more often than they should to whereas you don't know if it's a high-pitched little boy or a girl on the microphone <laughs> in a lobby. No, I just stole this uniform because it looked nice. Because I'm a fucking cop. <laughs> he, look, he had like the biggest sarcasm in his voice. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Honestly, in a zombie apocalypse, I would notice if there's another car behind me. Especially if it did that. Hey, could you open the glove box? Sure. There's a gun inside. Oh shit, there's a Better gun inside. A I'm a cop. What's good? No! You would, Leon. You can't just drive forward. He did. So dead. Still in one piece. <laughs> and so are you if you can get the fuck out of there. This is actually pretty funny. In some case scenarios, your seatbelt actually will be the cause of your death. Claire. It's fucked up if you think about it. Leon! I'm okay. Leon. I'll meet you there. Okay. So. They were parted by an unescapable destiny. This is just the beginning of their worst nightmare. In my pants. Mmm, them graphics. Go. They're actually pretty easy to avoid overall. Don't you fucking. Uh, don't you touch me. Get your dirty ass paws off me. Uh. They're, they're actually pretty easy to go around. Ooh! Oh! Ooh! Can't touch this. Mmm. Dun 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 dun. Can't touch this. Gun. Not even guns, just gun. Muji light? Okay. Freeze! Motherfucker. That gun out of my Who face. Are you? What are you doing here? Here to save your life. Hold your fire! I'm a human! <laughs> no shit. <laughs> he cocks it again. <sighs> Sorry about that. I thought you were one of them. What the fuck? Do I look What's like going one of them? On in this town? Hold on. He forgot to lock the I door. By the time I noticed something was Who wrong, the shit forgets to lock the door? They're trying to zombies. barricade themselves in a zombie apocalypse. Like, you nail the window shut and everything, but oops, forgot to lock that door. <laughs> uh, some bullets over here. Pick that up. Shit, did you see him, like, shoot the zombie right before he got fucking munched on? Like, fruit snacks in an elementary school? Man, I fucking love fruit snacks. I had fruit snacks recently in a... Like, I haven't had fruit snacks in years. And, uh, my mom bought some for some fucking reason. And I had some of that. I forgot how fucking delicious fruit snacks were. Want some? Come, come get it. Mm, Big Daddy. Forgot who's Big Daddy in? Isn't that the dude from Bioshock? Motherfucking robot. Y'all dead, right? All right. And then <laughs> he stopped breathing. <laughs> that was great. Pick up his shotgun. Uh, the streets are no longer secure. When in the shit? Leon, you were just out there five minutes ago. You think that was secure? Shit. There's a lot of... Because I don't believe anything's over here. Yeah. 
but uh oh, I forgot <laughs> uh hello yep they want that booty mmm y'all want some alley rape that's how your mom likes it hey if you want alley rape that's gonna cost you extra this booty don't come free it's gonna be two ninety nine and a bullet and another bullet because you did come on go to sleep it's all good. You did, son. Motherfucker, didn't I just say die? Mm, this shit ain't free, man. You gotta pay with your life. Oh, that was such a witty catchphrase. Something you would hear out of a like a super like an 80s superhero movie. You have to pay with justice. You dead, right? Damn right you did. Hmm. Oh wow, there's another one. Pick up them bullets. Probably reload actually, that's a better idea. Ooh! No! No! You picked the wrong person to alley rape, man. Who alley raped someone with a gun? And succeeds. Okay, let me re yeah, let me rephrase that. Who alley rapes someone with a gun and succeeds in the end? That's a cop. There's a cop playing b ball. Hey man, you want to play some basketball? It's your serve. It's all good. Fuck you. I ain't wasting my bullets on your ass. So speaking of old people, that reminds me. Um, I remember one word. Oh. Mm -hmm. Gotta press X. Um, speaking of old people, that reminds me. I remember one time I went over to my uh, my uh, grandparents' house because I wanted to go bowling with my grandpa. Cause me and him go bowling sometimes. Yo, look at that, it's the prostitute. Yo, prostituting ass down. It's illegal here. So I remember uh, I was going bowling with my grandpa. I got there early in the morning, and he wasn't awake yet. So while my brother was in the backyard, and my parents were gone, and he was asleep, it was just me and my grandma, like at the kitchen at the kitchen table uh, up at their house. And all of a sudden, I remember she's like, "Oh yeah, Yoshi, I forgot to ask you, you want a Coca-Cola?" And I was like, "No, thank you, Grandma. I don't want a Coca-Cola." <laughs> so I'm not even exaggerating when I say this, but I think about 15 seconds later. She's like, oh, I forgot to ask you, you want a Coca-Cola? <laughs> no, thank you, Grandma. I don't want a, no Coca-Cola. You ain't dead, bitch. Just act like you did. Exactly. <laughs> so, like, 15 seconds later, she's like, oh, yeah, yeah she forgot to ask you, you want a Coca-Cola? <laughs> no, thank you, Grandma. I don't want no Coca-Cola. <laughs> yeah, whatever. So, I think about two minutes passed, and she asked about five times, Oh yeah, Yoshi, you want a Coca-Cola? <laughs> no, thank you, Grandma. I don't want no Coca-Cola. But like eventually, like after those two minutes, like after five times she asked, I was like, yes, Grandma, I want a Coca-Cola. So she got me one, and, and I put it on the table, opened it, took like a sip, hello, took like a sip, and then put it back. Because I really didn't feel like having no fucking Coca-Cola. It was like early in the morning, I had like that taste in my mouth. Oh, shit! No! Go to sleep. So like, uh... I just took a sip and then put it on the table in front of me so that if she wanted to ask me, she could already see that I have it right there on the table. And, uh, and then another question came up. Oh, Yoshi, something wrong? You're not drinking your Coca-Cola. No, Grandma, everything's fine. <laughs> okay. It's your punk ass. I ain't playing with you. So eventually, she kept asking, like, is something wrong? Why don't you drink some of your Coca-Cola? Drink some of my Coca-Cola. Then I'll oh shit, did me dodge. Zigzag, bitch. Ooh, ooh, can't touch it. Da, na, na, na. Shit. Oh yeah, I got them skills that pay the bills. Um. So eventually, I did drink all of my Coca-Cola, and just like, as soon as I threw it away, it sat back down. I think about ten seconds later. Oh, I forgot to ask you, Yoshi. You want a Coca-Cola? So you gotta be fucking kidding me, Grandma. <laughs> 
I just had one. It's in the garbage can. <laughs> oh, no, I remember that. That was from last night. You sure you don't want a Coca-Cola? Yes, Grandma. And I think maybe that was, I gotta say, I went through like three or four cans of Coca-Cola that one morning. Longest fucking 45 minutes of my life. Eventually, my grandpa woke up. His fucking jackass was laughing. He was like, he knew what was going on. <laughs> he, he, he knew. Motherfucker was laughing. He was like, ha, 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 ha. And I was like, that ain't funny, grandpa. He eventually, you know, he's like, he like walked into the kitchen. He's like, come on, Yoshi, let's go bowling. Get away from your nutty ass grandma.